I used to really struggle with small group time as well. Um, because mainly in the preschool classroom, you are so busy and you're so needed. The students aren't completely independent yet, so you're needed to help problem solve, to help students in the bathroom, lots of questions everywhere. Um, and so something that I kind of settled myself on is that my students come three hours a day, four days a week, um, and so they have centers for an hour a day, so that's about four hours of center time. My goal is to get everybody over to my small group time at least once a week. So that might look like a group of four students um, for 10 minutes, one center time, and then I do that each day. Or I might do my entire small group in one day and then the rest of the week I'm really working on um, helping with things in the classroom. Now what am I doing in my small groups? So after the first few weeks and I've gotten everybody settled into the classroom, I start my preschool assessment. So that's an individual assessment that I sit and do, and that does take a few weeks because it's individual. After that, I'll move on to some name writing activities, and that typically is individual as well, unless they're really good at their name already, and I might do a group of three to four um, trying to work with them simultaneously. Beyond that, I know that we work on patterns really quickly, so I will call a group of um, three to five students over, depending on their ability, and we'll have a pattern game that we'll work on together. And I have a checklist where I'll mark off. Um, I'll kind of give them a score. So like if they're really good at patterning, it would be a three. If they're doing you know, okay with it, it would be a two. If they're really struggling still, it would be a one. That way I can kind of know where they're at with patterning um, when we work on it later in the year. I do this with many of the standards that we're working on. If we're working on measuring, I'll do a measuring small group and so on. And that's what I do throughout the year.